Hi guys and girls and welcome back to another video. In today's video we find out that I made Blender. Blender 2.8 was released. There's only one thing to do. Donate. I'm just kidding. I don't have money for that so we're just going to download. I'm kidding again because I already downloaded it. Now we just have to play it. I've seen some previews but I haven't worked in it. My god what happened here? What the actual fuck? This doesn't look like Blender anymore. What? Quick setup, okay, shortcuts, blender, I guess so, I want to keep in blender. Select with left or right, wait, 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 you're telling me I can now select with my left click? Is this blender anymore? I have to change that to right. Theme, oh yes. There's only two themes right now. Well, this looks like, kind of looks like, uh, you know that when you create a new project in Unreal Engine and then you create a new project in Unity and the one in Unreal Engine just looks better off the start. This is what I'm getting right now. Okay, first off, where the hell is the T menu? This is it. This is it. Okay, let's see what we can do here. A cursor. So the cursor location. Is this the the grease pen that was in before? Is that it? Because I never used it really. Oh man, what? You can measure? So for example, if I was making something, I could go like this. And a measure like four meters exactly. Okay, obviously we got object object mode, we got edit mode with tab. Okay, I guess this is better for beginners because you got all these uh functions here. You got extrude here, you got inset, you got bevel, loop cuts, knife. Like before when you looked at these, you there was nothing here. And now it's all here. So if you're installing mother for the first time, you got everything here. Okay, I noticed something up here, there's layout up here, then there's mod modeling, and it puts you in um, edit mode automatically. If I go to sculpting, it sets everything up for me. This is so fucking good. I can't explain to you, just the feeling of having to set up a sculpting project from the modeling one. I've done it like a million times, and I never want to do it again, and I don't have to. Look, you be editing, you just, you, you're modeling your thing, you model a sword, I don't know. You just click this and you, you unwrap it, you want to texture paint it, here you go. You can just go here. I love this, okay? This is the best thing ever. I'll probably say that for everything. You can use this as some kind of a preview scene. You can just uh, get your object in here, set up a few nodes. But you can just set it up here, see how it looks, you like it, you don't. Amazing. Oh, what if I go into... You can go into animation. Look at this. I mean... I need this. So basically they added a bunch of buttons somewhere that actually look clean and uh, can be used very well. Like for example, you can use this to swap, you don't have to figure out that you need to use your numpad to swap. I guess we have to make something to prove that it's okay. Whoa, okay, if you, god damn. If you press Z now, you can go into this selection menu, which I love. Because before, if you press Z, it would automatically swap between wireframe and solid. And now you can just go like this, and this is amazing. Okay, this is amazing. It'll take some time to get used to it, but it's amazing. Oh no, no. Okay, I need to know where do I change the select mode, like from uh, face to vertex, because this is not it. I can tell you that. Oh, it's up here. Yeah, it's up here, okay. I'm so annoyed by changing the control tab uh, shortcut from uh, changing select mode to, ch to changing the actual mode. If somebody knows how to change these very fast, the vertex face and, uh, and edge select mode, please let me know because uh, I'll go crazy. Okay, we got a head and I'm, ch I'm clicking control tab again. My god. There we go, we made half a human. He looks like... He broke his back, but okay. Now that Blender updated, hopefully he, uh, the Blender will have a bunch of new incomers. Is that a word? Well, because of that, I was thinking I create some kind of a general beginner tutorial for Blender, like with the hotkeys and where you need to look and stuff. So if you want to see that, like this video. Or just go tell me somewhere, like on Twitter, like, hey, I want you to make that video. And I'll do it. Or maybe you want me to show you how to create a low poly human again. 
because I learned a lot and I can probably teach you how to create a better one. Look, now he's green. Like Shrek. Well, yeah, that's it for today. I just wanted to let you all know that Blender 2.8 is out. And hopefully, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.